Alright, so we have two windows. First of all, with hello is the main user interface for our annotation tool, and the window back is for showing the back projection image of the cam shift tracker. The three track bars on the hello window are for controlling the three parameters of the cam shift tracker, and the numbers here are the rel relative position and time of the current frame. So first, the number one means that we are at the the first frame, and f and we are at the forty milliseconds on the timeline. And now, if we press P, it'll get us into the next frame. And uh, instead of uh, pressing the sp and I'm sorry, I pressed the space bar for that function. Uh, so instead of pressing space bar again and again, like this, we can press P and it plays the video and press it again and pause the video. And so we have the object, so we can label it by clicking twice. And you can see that the tracker is initialized and the check window of the tracker is shown on the image by the red ones. And uh, so we can press spacebar again and again, and it checks the object. And uh, like this, if we play the video, and you can see that there are some imperfect frames. So we, we would like to label the object manually for these frames. Okay, the video starts again from the beginning. Uh, so that's it. And uh, if we can label it again, and it initializes the checker, and if we place the label on the window, but we are not satisfied with the label, we just give. We can press R to reset it and label it again, and it will check the object. And label these frames manually. Because the tracker is incapable of checking. The object to properly. Alright, so if we press J, it's the same function as spacebar. And like this, we go K is the next frame and J is the previous frame. So we for K it goes into the next frame you can see on the numbers here and if we press J it's going going backwards 